Hello everyone, this is Stunt Collector here with another action figure review, and here we have the Marvel Legends uh, Volts Guardsman. So, here is the front with that Iron Man logo, Volts Guardsman, Marvel Legends logo on the top there, Cider of Volt Guardsman. And here's the back, if you guys want to pause and read that, you can. Marvel Legends logo on the top right, and then here we're building Ursa Major. Uh, we already went through the modular Iron Man, we're working on uh, Volt Guardsman. Uh, Stealth Stew. Stealth Suit Iron Man still, uh, Dark Star, uh, we already did Iron Heart, Hologram Iron Man, and we still need to do Ultron. Here's the other side with that same art. Here is the top with the Iron Man logo furnished. And then here's the bottom with the DCPI. But besides that, let's crack them open. And here is Volt's Guardsman, and Guardsman out of the package here. So let's go over the accessories. So first you get Ursa Major's left hand or arm, and we'll save that for the next so once we build them, and then you get two fisted hands for them with this nice shiny green here. It's a little bit of a dark green with some light sheen to it. it looks like it's a little marbled actually. But yeah, you get two of those. Same mold that we've seen before with those fisted hands. And then we get this pistol, which we've also seen before, but it's completely blacked out, matted black. So yeah, there's the blaster for him. But besides that, that's all we got for accessories for him. So here is Volt Guardsman out of the package here. So first you get some, um, you get this like little helmet over his head here. Um, it's like a darker green, uh, but then the actual mask inside here. So each side is lighter green, shiny green. The neck piece here is light green and you get this like little chest here, a uh, little chest pad area here with that dark green abs or light green you get that little pelvis area uh with that dark green it looks like there's a little bit of marbling in there legs are light green with the boots being dark green and you get those like uh those little stripes around his bicep here with the dark green dark green gloves these are gun holding hands um but yeah, here's the back. There's not a whole lot going on with the figure besides the fact that it's shiny and has a lot of green with it. You also get the white eyes for him. I totally forgot to mention that. Um, but yeah, this is what I remember being in the comics. I remember I do have Volt's Guardsman from the Iron Man 1 game, but... I think that's what he would have looked like if uh, he was in the MCU, but let's go over the articulation for him. So he has a disc ball joint head, so you can look. I think he's either stuck or he just won't go down. I don't wanna break it. All right, you can look down that far. Jesus. And you can look up that far. And then you can look left and right. Not, no head pivoting. Shoulders can move out just that far. You can do 360 rotation around the shoulder, bicep swivel, double jointed elbows, wrists can hinge down that far, up that far, 360 rotation there. He has an ab crunch so you can go forward just that far, backwards just that far. He has a waist swivel so 360 rotation around there. Legs can kick out that far, forward a decent amount, backwards not a whole lot. Thigh cut, double jointed knees. Boot cut, ankles can hinge down that far, up that far, nice ankle pivot. And this is him next to what I think he would have looked like in the MCU, but this is from the Iron Man game. So yeah, that's um, Volt's Guardsman. Um, I think he's a pretty cool figure to have. I don't really know much about the uh, character in the comics or anything like that. I just know that he was in the Iron Man game. I think that was him, if I remember. Uh, he came with the Ray Matty accessories, I think, and... Uh, the colors look really cool on them a lot and articulation is kind of meh like it's pretty hard to move the head up and down but i think that's just uh the paint being a little sticky um and then abs can barely move forward that uh forward a whole lot so and the shoulders too um i feel like it's an old uh, body sculpt because the pegs are the uh joint pegs there um so yeah um, but yeah, that's all I got for this figure. I think you could, if you want to do like comics, 
um, villain shelf, definitely grab them, which is what I'm doing. Um, so yeah, and uh, that's all I really got for this figure. Um, so yeah, uh, make sure you guys check out my link tree in the description for my TikTok, Instagram, Twitter, uh, Facebook page, and I also got my PayPal in there if you guys want to donate a little bit of extra money to help support my YouTube um since i'm having to take care of college stuff and then save up for an apartment so if you guys could do that i would really appreciate it uh, i'm not telling you you have to just if you want to help out the channel a little bit um but besides that that's all i got so thanks for watching